Okay, so this week we are beginning in access. This is usually a difficult topic for some students because it may be new to you. You should first read the lecture and watch the videos so you get a basic understanding of access before you begin working in the project this week. The complete weekly assignment week 11 page has more detailed information about the assignment that we'll be completing today. You may want to complete the training for access because it's a little more challenging than what you'll be seeing in the textbook right now. And for now, we're going to go ahead and download the start files from access. So the first thing you'll want to do is click on this link, module one textbook project. So go ahead and click on that. And then you'll want to load the page. So you'll want to click here. And this should open SAM. Your screen is probably going to look a little bit different than mine because I am using the instructor screen, but you should be able to follow along with what I'm saying. You want to download these two files, the start file and the support file, so just click on them. If you're using Google Chrome in BDI, they'll appear here at the bottom of the page. So you should get a warning. It will say this type of file can harm your computer. Do you want to keep it anyway? And you'll want to click on keep for both of those files. Click keep. So the first thing we're going to do is open up the start file. Let's just say new Microsoft database. And you'll want to enable content in order for us to edit what's in the database. The first thing you're going to want to do is save the file to your drive. So you'll want to click File. And we're going to click Save As. And we want to save it as a database. So that should be the default. And click on Save As. Do you want Microsoft to close the objects? You want to say yes. So just click yes. And then you'll want to scroll and find the drive that you saved your Comp 101 file to. So in this case, the student drive, the S drive, if you're using VDI, you must save to the S drive or your file will disappear. So you'll want to go into your Comp 101 folder and then into your Access folder in Chapter 1. And you're going to rename this the name that Sam wants you to have. In this case, it's CMS underscore vet underscore and then your first and last name. So I'm going to put my name in here and I'm going to click save. Okay, so you'll want to close that and then go to the support document, do the same thing. So open that. We are going to click File, Save As. You still want to save it as a database, so you click Save As. And we don't want to change the name for this, but it, depending on how many times you downloaded this file, it may give you a number at the end. So I'm going to take that out. So you want it to say, Support AC, CMS, VETS, Extra, and Tables. So that's how you want it to say. So you go ahead and click. Oh, I didn't navigate to my, my folder. So I'm going to go into the S drive, Comp 101, Access, Chapter 1. And then I'm going to go ahead and click Save. So now you'll have both of those files. 